This program is about unsolved mysteries, foodborne illness. Whenever possible, the actual faculty members have participated in recreating the events. What you are about to see is not a news broadcast. Our story today begins at Deerpark Junior High. After a faculty lunch, teachers left feeling unwell. Thinking it was from the stress of the day, they went home to rest. But what happened in the next few hours was something no one saw coming. I snuck into the FCS kitchen because I was totally craving some, some cookie dough. just puking everywhere, explosive diarrhea everywhere. I mean, what could I have eat? What, what, oh my God. Well, I have been sick for almost two weeks. I was in the hospital. I had a stroke. My face is still recovering. I can't completely smile all the way. I'm tingly. Um, it started like after our faculty lunch but I didn't eat any of that except the salad. Um, nothing was undercooked. It, the, everything on the salad was, was done. Um, I have no idea what could have possibly made me so sick. Oh. It all started about 30 minutes after I had some potato salad at the faculty luncheon. Uh, I thought it tasted okay at the time, but my stomach has been in knots and I felt horrible for almost a whole day. I don't understand what happened. Oh. Uh, the longest 24 hours of my life, y'all. So I ate some biscuits and gravy and sausage. The sausage was really cold. And I don't know what it is, y'all. Something is bad happening in here. I just, maybe the sausage made me sick. Oh. Never thought this was the way I was gonna go. One day you're there, one day you're not. One day you're eating some canned peaches, and the next you're dead. I started seeing double at night, couldn't swallow anything. I went to the ER, and my body just didn't function anymore. It's just the weirdest thing, you know, being dead. Today, we have heard five stories with no endings. Five stories of teachers thrown into extraordinary situations. Perhaps someone out there has the clues. Perhaps they are watching. Perhaps that someone is you.